Kilo Juliet Four Yankee Zulu India. Uh, very good, Alex. You're five and I guess seven on this old analog meter here in Florida. Name is Eric. Over. Yeah, uh, Roger. Good luck, seven three. Ah. <laughs> Well, everyone, here it is. Check it out. I got it working. Oh, I'm excited. Yeah. <laughs> no, I didn't waste $350. I have no idea if this radio is in tip top shape. But let me show you what I found. Now, pull up the manual here that I have on the computer. In the manual, in the beginning video, I did tell you that I did research and look. Now one of the issues is the CW filter must be jumpered internally, which I, you know, or else if you're using the external CW filter in the back, you, you disable the internal jumper. So when I had the case on, let's see if we can see this. When I had the case on, I thought it was jumpered internally. Look at the black wire that was cut. Now evidently I couldn't see that through the case. So I just put this simple jumper wire on there and listen, listen. It's working. Uh, I don't know the condition of if this thing is outputting full 100% power. I do not know if it's in tune or if it's hurting or needs caps. But I do want to say thank you everybody who uh, threw some comments out there and said, Hey, check this, and, and taught me about where this radio came from, what the high gain label means, uh, all about this radio. You guys commenting, I learned a lot. I am planning on going through this radio. In the meantime, what I plan on doing right now is hopefully getting that wire soldered so I can put the cover back on. Maybe I'll hit it with some compressed air in there, blow it out. I'm gonna wire up this D104 and get on this international phone contest this weekend. I'm gonna get on there and work some DX with this monster and hopefully I get some power output. Uh, in the meantime, I have received. Now I can hear it's already drifting. It hasn't been warmed up that much. Uh, I haven't done the tune-up procedure. I'm gonna check all that. All right, here I am, so I'm playing with the soldering a jack on this uh, D104 here. Got the <laughs> mic wiring and the screen back there. I'm soldering on my poor Ultraspank CD case that I don't know why I did that. <laughs> Anyways, it is keying up. All right, I shouldn't show you this. You see that spot in my finger right there? You see that spot? Yeah. That was right there on the top of the tube. <laughs> that was an accident, right? Look. Look at that. Man, that hurts so bad. Yep, y'all said it. I learned my lesson. There's my little jumper wire I put on. I didn't have time to get in there and really clean it up nice, but uh, I just put a jumper there for the CW filter. It's working. 7-3 everybody. KJ4, YZI.